Hi everyone, this is Seven Miraculous Studios channel, and I'm Dmitry Baranov. Today you'll see something special. We're going to see the very first run of an outdoor waterfall. There's water pouring behind me. We need water to make the waterfall work. We are waiting until this pond is full. I can't wait to see the result. I'm pretty sure it'll work great. Seven Miraculous Studios artists made an enormous work during the season. The scope of work included welding, shotcreting, carving, painting, decorating with natural stones, setting up pumps and filtration systems, and much, much more. The major part of our work is a combination of many little things that the client doesn't even see. Today we're going to share some of our secrets. The project is full of innovative designs and engineering solutions. For example, the pumping system is hidden inside the stones. There's easy access to the unit forming elements. Look what's inside this rock. It's a dry technical room that also serves as a filtration room. An artificial outdoor waterfall like this is a loop hydraulic system with water circulation. This circulation allows us to imitate a real mountain river running around. All this together comprises a rocky waterfall composition. The artificial grotto gives the whole structure a fantasy-like appearance and offers an unusual view of the waterfall from the inside. Like any other waterfall, this one should get water from somewhere to function. An artificial waterfall needs a pumping system that will make the water circulate all over again. The size of the pumps depends on water volume and flow intensity. Water flows through here. Our waterfall is here. These are the first and the second waterfalls. Water flows from the headstream and goes through the waterfall to the big pond. Here, the second and the third streams converge and run here too. The pumping equipment that makes this system work consists of several pumps. This pump delivers water to this point, but it cannot pump water to the top. So we have intermediate pumps here. From this point, water gets to the top. The same is here. The pump delivers water to the waterfall's intake. From there, water gets into the top pond. Another pump delivers water to the very top. The third stream gets water from this pump. Moreover, there are skimmers that take water from the pond's surface and bring it back to the bio plateau. Meanwhile, auxiliary pumps send it to the filtration system. There is also a filter through which water comes back into the pond. It's vital for a hydraulic system to be well designed, mounted and connected. Otherwise, it won't work right. The whole structure is decorated with natural stones that are lined along the waterfall riverbed. The preparatory works have been mostly completed, and now it's time to proceed to the next step, perform the first run of the waterfall. To be honest, everybody was looking forward to seeing it. The first run of the waterfall. This is going to be stunning. This is going to be spectacular. Everybody's holding their breath. Get ready. 10 seconds before we start. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wow, it's amazing! The idea of Seven Miraculous Studio was to make water run in such a way that it created a sort of mirror wall. The original design required that the space outside the grotto could be seen from within through this mirror wall. These ideas have been implemented to the full extent. It's called a laminar flow. The water drop is 4 meters. The outflow and the laminar flow are wide. The laminar flow serves as a curtain that covers the mouth of the grotto, as per the original design. However, you can look through this curtain. This is what we wanted to achieve. The grotto at the bottom of the waterfall was designed to unveil the other side of the waterfall 
and not just be a simple passage. This is why it's unique. The outflow is wide enough to cover this opening. It's hidden if you look at it from this side. When you get into the grotto, you see the running water from the inside. An outdoor waterfall will make any landscape unique and eye-catching. Flowing water makes you feel good and relaxed. What a wonderful sound. Just listen. Unfortunately, sometimes it is hard to channel water to the desired route. It turned out that there were too many little stones in the artificial riverbed. The Seven Miracula team eliminated the problem and the flow ran smoothly to the main pond. The waterfall is running. It looks great. It didn't go smoothly at first, but we made it. There were two issues. First, water was running in the wrong direction because the stones had been laid out in the wrong way. But we coped with it. Still, we have yet another issue. There is something wrong with one of the riverbeds. It seems that the pump is malfunctioning. But in general, it all went fine, the way we wanted. As you can see, the waterfall is functioning well. So I would say our main goal is achieved. The unsettled issues with both streams are trivial and can be easily fixed. It's almost impossible to predict the exact result based on water pressure and supply charts only. There is always some uncertainty. For this reason, it always required to perform a dry run and make appropriate adjustments. Sometimes all goes well. Sometimes not. This is why we call this stage startup and commissioning works. This is what we have been doing today. A filtration system is essential to keep the ecosystem and ponds clean. If you don't provide it, water will get moldy and silty very soon. This will ruin the image of your forest waterfall. The running water gets clean naturally and gets saturated with oxygen. However, it might not be enough. We will use a special filter and disinfection system for keeping the pond clean to prevent the water from getting moldy and maintain the entire ecosystem. It is planned to create a bioplateau in the shallow water. It is clear that even after the dry run of the waterfall, there is still a lot of work ahead of us. We have to do a lot of things before the waterfall is ready. The startup run is over. It was spectacular. It was amazing. I'm so impressed. I think it was great. Subscribe to our channel. Like this video. Don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you don't miss upcoming videos. Stay tuned. Bye.